Good morning, everybody. It's Jess here with Blush Jess. I've also got Lucy with me, and I'm sorry for this lighting. It's really sunny, so I have my visor down. And we are moving, which I normally don't film while I drive. However, we're moving about one inch a second. <laughs> um, it is really, really bad traffic this morning. We were already running late. We're going to ladies breakfast this morning. We were already running late and then we got stuck in road work. So I just want to say welcome to the vlog. I am going to do a daily vlog, what I ate today video. I need the accountability because I have not, I've been doing good with my food, but I have not been doing good with my water. I just feel really bloated. Like I have not drank enough. So this is the first ladies breakfast that I've done on keto. Um, and so I kind of went back and forth on what to do, whether I should make something keto friendly or just eat before I go. So what I decided to do was just take a bulletproof coffee with me and, um, just not worry about eating breakfast. I didn't want to like go through the trouble of making this huge, like keto thing and nobody else is doing keto really. So, um, I made some sausage, little sister Schubert sausage rolls that you just put in the oven. So I'm bringing that, but I'm not going to eat any of those. And, um, I'm going to get some clips of ladies breakfast for you guys. It's probably going to be a small day, like a small crowd today. A lot of our people, um, have other plans. It's a beautiful fall day. I've got Lucy with me in the back seat looking all Hello. fall. And I'm in my cute jacket. She has the cutest. You guys remember when I went to the consignment sale and I got her that little pea coat. Um, it's like a peach corally pinkish. <coughs> She's still coughing. <laughs> We're all still coughing, but we're feeling better. Drink some drink, Luce. Drink some drink. Um, she looks so cute in her little boots. I'm wearing my stitch. This whole outfit is stitch fit, so I'm going to have to show you. I'm wearing my pants. I got them. I did get them to move them to a 16, and they're still, they fit, but I don't know how much longer they're going to fit, so I'm probably going to have to sell them soon. They're Liverpool pants, and they're so comfortable. They're black, like kind of like jean material but they totally could look they like black like dress pants they're really, really comfortable well. and then I'm wearing my this top which most of y'all or not most of y'all about half of y'all said you didn't it's like so this top I like this top it maybe it's doesn't so look as good on top. camera the top okay so I'm wearing this top and then I have my little sweater on top so I'm all stitch fixed oh, stitch so fixed out <laughs> and um I'll leave my referral link down below if anyone wants to try stitch fix it's a lot of fun um it's a lot of fun and it, with my code, you can try it for free, basically. You get $25 off. So, um, anyway, go see my video about that. Maybe I'll link that down below, too. But I'm loving my Stitch Fix clothes. They're so comfortable. That's the biggest difference is they're so comfortable. But, anyway, I've got my humongous Bulletproof coffee. I put it in, like, okay, we're stopping, so let me show you. That's my Bulletproof coffee. <laughs> it has a tablespoon of butter. Well, like maybe like half a tablespoon of butter, a tablespoon of MCT oil, and two tablespoons of heavy cream, and it's delicious, and it will keep me full until lunch, past lunch probably, so I will not be tempted. But anyway, we're moving, so I'll see you guys at ladies' breakfast. outside because I'll walk inside and I feel hot. Um, I stopped and had the kids some food. It is now 1240. Uh, nothing else really going on. I'm hoping we'll get out and do something on. David's watching football. 
not too exciting. I'm not that hungry. I kind of feel nauseated. But I had that big bulletproof coffee, and when I eat something, I'll show you. Did get these. Um, our food pantry at church um, got these strawberries, and they needed to be used up. She had a bunch of them, so I took two of these Driscoll's organic strawberries. They look pretty good. There's a few spots so I'm just going to cut off, but I'm going to get these washed up, and then... Lucy got to bring home a big bowl of grapes. Look at those, they're huge. Um, that a lady didn't want to take home. So that was awesome. Did you have fun, Luce? Yeah. She had fun. And I'm not sure what else we're going to do today. But I'll let you guys know the next time I eat something. Did you eat, honey? David had a, had a big breakfast. He had a big breakfast. He made himself an omelet. So. And bacon. Oh, wow. And, and bacon. that leftover being a blanket. Okay, so he had a big breakfast. I just had the coffee, but I guess it was just so much fat at once. I felt a little queasy. Then driving home, we hit more traffic, so stop and go on the way home. Um, I need to get to Target sometime to, in the next few days to get Lucy some pants. I thought she was going to be in 3T pants this year, and um, that's like what I bought her for this year because last year she was in twos, and she's not. She needs forks for the length, so... We need to find her some pants because it's getting nice and chilly and she has just a few pair like maybe two pairs of like thin stretchy pants but she doesn't have any jeans Mommy, i think target i think target. i already took off my sweater Mommy, because i got hot Come on. Come on. oh i didn't show you guys my outfit let me put my, my shirt on and i'll show you my outfit all right you guys this isn't the best look um mirror look here but here's my outfit these are the 16s i should have probably got smaller because in another probably a couple weeks, they aren't going to fit too good because they fit just right right now. But anyway, and then I can take this off. I think it looks pretty put together. I still am looking for more pieces for fall and winter because I do not have a whole lot of warm stuff. This is like the only little cardigan I have. Um, so I like it, I'm just going to add it piece, you I like know, a little bit at a time. I like it. Thank you. And what else was I going to say? I don't know. I don't know. Everybody's feeling better. We're still coughing, but so much better than we were a week or two. <coughs> Cue the coughs. So anyway, I'm going to keep feeding the kids, and I'll see you guys back the next time I eat. All right, you guys. It's 1.26. I'm going to go ahead and eat just because I don't feel so good. I feel kind of nauseated. Maybe I'm just hungry. So I have a little wrap here. I made it with these La Tortilla Factory Low Carb Whole Wheat Tortillas. These only have three net carbs. They're only 50 calories, and I think they're really, really good. So I have one of those with a piece of pepper jack cheese and a few pieces of this rotisserie seasoned chicken breast. And then this is my new favorite obsession. I'm going to kind of dip it in here. This stuff is so good. It has a little kick to it. I definitely don't think it's mild. It's more medium, but it's so good. And then I just have a handful of pecans. So that's my little snacky lunch. I'll see you guys back at dinner. So I gotta get this on camera, y'all. Nate is eating. Y'all know what these are? Nate is eating Fruit Loops. He is eating Fruit Loops. He has never once liked sugary things. <laughs> I can't believe I'm so excited that he's eating Fruit Loops. But watch, well, watch. Everybody, let's just take this in. He keeps saying fruity cereal. <laughs> Look at this. Nate, who are you? I'm so excited for Nate. Yay. He's eating Fruit Loops. Holy cow, bud. Good job, buddy. All right, you guys. So we are getting in the car. I am feeling a little better. I don't know why I felt so queasy. Even after I ate lunch, I did not feel that good. Um, but we're headed to Target. We're just getting out of the house for a little while. Nate, Nate and Daddy have been locked down all day. So we're getting out of the house. What is it, like 4 o'clock? Something like that. We're going to look for Lucy some clothes. I want to go to Dollar Tree. We're not going to take Nate to Dollar Tree because see that vlog if you missed it. Um, we're not quite there yet. And I want to go get some stuff to redo the laundry area of our apartment. It's a hot mess. Like serious business, a hot mess. So I want to get some bins and stuff to be able to organize a little bit. That's not tight enough. So I am going to Target slash Dollar Tree. These are pajama pants, <laughs> but it's warmed up and I don't want to wear my jeans. 
So we're in the car. We're gonna go take out the trash, go to Target, and then I guess Dave is gonna sit in the car while I run into Dollar Tree. So that's the plan. And then we're gonna come back because he's gotta watch Georgia football. Seriously? Alabama starts at seven. Alabama starts at seven. Georgia's playing right now, but we should be back before that's over. So I'm gonna go with mom inside. All right, let's go. For multiple videos, our I'm dinner video I, and our daily vlog, and I totally forgot. Once the food comes, I'm like cutting up stuff for everybody. But I just had a single cheeseburger with no bun. It was a real small one, so I'm probably gonna need to snack later. And I just put it. They have like a whole toppings bar, so I put some pickles and some lettuce. It was really good, and some ranch. And David had a, had a bacon cheeseburger. Lucy had chicken and french fries. Nate has cheeseburger and french fries. Mommy, I'm to he ended up not eating lunch. Like, hold on a second. He ended up not eating his cheeseburger at lunch. I don't know why. Um, so he didn't have two cheeseburgers. He just had one. Um, and he had those Fruit Loops earlier. Just kind of a weird day for him. But anyway, we were going to go to the Dollar Tree after Cheeseburger Bobby's because it's right in the same strip. Um... And just let David and Nate stay in the car. However, I took Nate to the bathroom after we ate. And his pants were soaked. I guess he didn't tell us he had to go potty. And for whatever reason, I did not have the diaper back. So, I'm in the bathroom with him with wet pants. And once you take his pants off, and he will not put them back on wet. Which I don't blame him. But, we're in the bathroom. And we have to walk through the restaurant. 
and I'm like, I cannot walk out here. He's six. Like, he's not a little baby I can just hold, you know? I can't walk out here without pants on. So I had to take my sweater off and wrap it around him like a dress, and we just came home. So he's in the bathtub with Daddy. Now, me and Lucy are headed back to the Dollar Tree. I I'm really... Tell, okay, I'm just one second. Me. I really want to redo the laundry room, like I've said multiple times in this video but our laundry room is a mess so I want to get some bins and stuff maybe I could work on that tonight that's why I really want to go to Dollar Tree and Lucy wanted to come with me okay what do you really want to say uh, hurry because we gotta go because he has to stay home with daddy yeah so daddy and him are staying home we'll, we'll get really bright me and Lucy are headed to the Dollar Tree I'm gonna have to go around the world to get there because there's some really bad construction work you. on the interstate. So it took us you. a while to get home. I, think I love you too. We're going to go to the Dollar no, Tree. When I we get home, something. hold on a second. When we get home, I will probably just show you like what we got instead of doing any filming inside because I'm trying to hurry. So. I to my Last one. Last thing. I love you. Oh, we love you. Okay, we'll see you guys back when we get home. Okay, you guys, we are home from the Dollar Tree and I just went ahead and put the kids to bed. Dave was watching the football game. And I'm sitting here by our entryway. <laughs> um, this is where we have our big freezer. And I just threw all the stuff we bought at Dollar Tree. I spent $27 at the Dollar Tree. But I got a lot of good stuff. Um, so I thought I'd just show you what I got. I'm, I wanted to do the laundry. Like start working on it tonight. Um, but I'm going to have to. I realize I'm going to have to move some stuff around. That's in there to Nate's room. And I don't want to wake him up. So I'll probably have to start on it either tomorrow. Or maybe Monday when the kids are in school. So. I feel like that is heavy on me. <laughs> I've got this um, little coat rack. Oh, I'm afraid it's going to break. Okay, so let me show you what I got. So, first of all, this is in there saying she's not tired. Okay, well then just be quiet. I have something I need to mail off to um, my cousin. And I have no tape. Actually, I know I have tape. I just can't find it. Again, that is the reason why I need to redo this laundry room because I know it's in there somewhere, but I really need to nail it off. So I just bought like a single little thing of tape. This is not the cheapest way to buy tape. Lucy, hold on. Um, Lucy keeps yelling. I'm trying to do this. Um, <laughs> anyway, so I just got a little roll of tape. Dollar Tree. And then Lu I had Lucy with me, of course. So she also picked out a little Paw Patrol toy and these socks. So these are Belle. She has some that are Sky that are the same brand and they've held up really well and they're really good. So she likes to sleep in these socks. So I wanna let her get that. And okay, you guys, so I'm gonna try to get this without any more interruptions. Anyway, they had their Christmas stuff out and I always get my treat boxes. I always make gifts for teachers and people at church. I do like homemade um, gift boxes and I love the last few years that they've carried these that have the see-through lids It's perfect to put like fudge or something because you can see through it And so I went ahead and got six of them I'm probably gonna have to get some more because it's not gonna be enough But Nate has several several teachers and then there's other people we give it to but they have this little design with the candy cane I got two of those And then I got two of these that say Merry Christmas and then I got two of these. I like this one the best. I think it has a candy cane. And then it has little ornaments on the side. So I got six of those. And like I said, that's probably not enough. But also, we are doing a fundraiser next week at church. And our kitchen at church is very bare bones, let's just say. And so I like to bring a lot of my stuff with me. And one of the things I've learned is when I do fundraisers to bring a pack of these because there's not a lot of paper towels. There's not a lot of dish towels, but these are perfect because I can wipe stuff up. I can even wash dishes with these. They're the Brillo Basics. It comes with 12 little cloths in here. You can reuse them. I love them. I'm teaching children's church tomorrow and we're doing something that requires these building stuff with these and toothpicks. So we got a pack of these spice drops, two packs. And the kids have several of these Daniel Tiger books. I really like them. They're easy to read for kids and they love Daniel Tiger. So Lucy has one in her bed right now. We read, I think it was Daniel Tiger school, something that plays at school. And then we also got visits to the library and Daniel learns to share. So we got those two, her and Nate both love those. And then tomorrow is Pastor Appreciation Day, so we're going to be at church um, through lunch. We're going to have a lunch for the pastor. So um, I always try to bring something fun for Lucy to do. So I saw this little play pack, and it comes with 
stickers and a coloring sheet and crayons. So I'll let her pick out one. She picked many. Okay, there's the other one of these. And then I've been really trying to plan out stuff more, like in my little notebook, plan out videos, plan out bills and stuff. And so I got these little stickers. Um, they have arrows, stars, hearts, exclamation points, dollar signs, um, mail, food, little stickers. So I just like these little ones. They're cute to decorate with. And, okay, the rest of the stuff I think is for the laundry room. So I'm not sure exactly how I'm going to do it. I, this is how I organize. I go get the stuff. And I just make it work. Like whatever I get, I just make it work. So I got three of these. I thought these would be really good to store paper towels in because they're really big um, toilet paper, just random like bigger stuff. And they're very sleek, square, good size. So I got three of those. Um, and then I thought this would be good to put like either dish, um, not dish, laundry tabs, like little pods. Uh -huh. Or... Um, the dryer sheets. It's just a clear little box, which I like clear for that kind of stuff because I can see when I get low. I also have been wanting um, a little trash. There is a bigger trash can in there, um, but I like to just have all the dryer sheet stuff together and then throw it away at once. So I'm going to make a little place for this little trash basket. Um, if I don't end up using it in there, I am going to put this in my room on my desk, by my desk, because I always need it. So... And then I also got a card for our pastors. This is just a thank you card. It's blank on the inside. I looked all over for like something that would be appropriate. And they had several different things, but they were all a little bit too girly. Um, so I just got a blank one. And then I got three of these containers. I'm not sure exactly. I just thought they looked really nice. They looked like a basket weave. So... I am going to film when I do the laundry room because our laundry room is seriously so bad. Um, I've used it for storage for so long, for different office supplies, for jewelry, anything random I throw in, in there. So I will definitely film <laughs> before and after so you'll get to see how I use all this. But this is all, everything we got at the Dollar Tree. You know how it is. You get sucked in and there. Um, but I think, I really do think everything that I got is going to be used, especially these little gift boxes i'm so excited every year when they come out and i know it's only october but if you don't buy these now they'll be gone and i like to like look through and make sure i don't get any ones a lot of them come dented and stuff so i i pick out like the ones that are perfect and i'll just put them um away in the closet and then i'll have them at christmas time when you can't find them anymore so that's a little tip there we ate dinner you guys saw well you heard about that and I told you it wasn't huge so I'm probably gonna be hungry later if I am I'm gonna drink a protein shake or that's probably what I'll do is I'll drink a protein shake so I know another day of not that exciting food but I found on keto like it just food isn't as big of a deal like it's also filling like that bulletproof coffee this morning I had that wrap and then I had the burger and that was really it and I haven't been hungry so I know the what I ate today's are not that exciting, but I hope you still enjoy coming along with us. Who knew that Nate liked Fruit Loops or he would even try Fruit Loops? And I have tried before and he hasn't tried them, but he did today, so that was awesome. I'm just glad everybody's feeling better. We're going to be back at church tomorrow. I'm doing children's church, and then we have pastor appreciation and all that. I might try to vlog tomorrow. Would you guys like to see that? By the time you answer me, I will have either done it or not. <laughs> but if I have a chance, I will try to vlog and maybe show you... Um, a little bit of our church and how that all goes so also today i got notified that my debit card had been tried to use had been tried to they tried to use it at a footlocker in wisconsin <laughs> they were like three four hundred dollar charges and thankfully my bank caught it and stopped it but anyway praise the lord for that because wow so we had that going on too, just, you know, one of those crazy days with ladies breakfast and then that was going on in the middle of ladies breakfast and then we went out with the kids and the Dollar Tree, busy day. So thank you for following me along today. If you like this kind of video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below. Please subscribe if you are new. I do post videos every single day on this channel. I'll see you guys all later.